what's going on everybody welcome back to the channel so don't got a lot of time today probably like five hours worth of fishing so i decided to you know try my luck down here i haven't been here this spring and last year we made some really good videos here catching a bunch of two pounders so hopefully they're here i don't know for sure but before this video starts just want to give a shout out to slides super rep off 391 i'll put the address on the screen right now uh they started carrying our jigs we just put them in there yesterday so they're stocked up if you don't want to wait on shipping and you're a local head down there and pick you up some uh, i made i think two custom colors that's not released anywhere else so i'm probably going to be using one of those today try it out so y'all make sure y'all go over there and pick some up but i didn't put any gas in the boat so this right here is going to be our stomping grounds i got my scale with me so maybe we'll catch a big one i don't even know if there's any fish here we may not even catch nothing but it's just going to be a lot of trolling motor today Let's see what we can figure out All right, let's talk about the setup right before we get while we're trolling out here. Setup I'm using there, I got a half ounce sinker. I got two bobber stops on it, keeping it still. We got a 124 ounce jig head with a custom color that's exclusive to Sly Super Rit Snipe Beaver. It's kind of like a June bug berry, I guess. Uh, 13 foot ACC lose rod and i'm running 10 pound braid today 10 pound of strike king braid so let's see how long it takes me to break it because it's been a real issue here lately but let's get out here and see if we can find us some tacos I don't think that fish was ever gonna bite. <laughs> nice little chunker. Let's get a weight on him. Since we did bring the scale. Pound five. Not bad fish to start today. This little chunker. Pretty nice one. Not a big one, another probably pound, pound 20. <coughs> Add to the board. We slowly getting her done. <laughs> Fish having commitment issues today. I'm trying, trying a little smaller swim bait. See if that helps any. That one kind of committed to it. But I guess we shall see if any of the other ones have any commitment issues. Just gotta figure out what they want. Feisty. Uh, he ate a little bit, huh? Let me 
It's not a super big one. But he did eat. So one of the main issues I'm having right now was commitment. Like they come out there and look at it, but can't get them to eat good. Maybe they want something smaller. I've been throwing a lot of bigger stuff, but sometimes they just want that little small little minnow. So we'll figure it out. I'm using a little purple and crappy man green. There's not a lot of fish here. I mean, there's enough to catch a good mess to eat. A super bunch of them. Oh man, we got a hammer, guys. <laughs> Get in here. Ah, the dang sinker hit me. That's what I'm talking about right there. It wasn't the one we missed, but it's about the same size. I think that little minnow is what they want. That's a nice one right there. Let's get a weight on her. Get a weight on her. Bigger than 113. It's all, almost two pounds. Come on, give me the two pounds. <laughs> so a little bit more. As I came up 114 and one, one 116 is two pounds. So, well, two ounces off, I guess. So about a pound 80. Nice fish. Got He's bigger than the other one though. A little bit fatter. Good weight on him. Why not? One point five. Not a bad fish. That chunky one. Wind's starting to pick up now. It's all good. We got a full trolling motor battery. Oh, 
not a fat one. For some reason I'm not feeling the, the bites with this braid. Another nice fat chunky one. Probably about a pound probably about a pound. I don't know, pound twenty I guess. Nice healthy fish. We starting to get us a little shrink going on now, guys. Heck yeah. Finally. I ain't gotta chase that fish forever. <laughs> I thought he was a lot bigger than that though. I mean, it's a good 11 inch here, but. It definitely ain't biting as good as they have been. They're not wanting to stay still either. Lots of chasing around. Figured this out, guys. Crappy man green, a little minnow. <laughs> ain't as big as that one, but ain't good keeper. I want y'all to check out this string that we got going on. The wind started blowing pretty bad, so I stopped recording. The wind's probably still a little bad right now for audio, but y'all check this out, right? Uh huh. <laughs> And I mean, I have switched colors, switched profiles, and I was like, man, I'm just gonna put on a crappy man green little minnow. And these fish are actually eating it instead of just barely hitting it. So heck yeah. I don't know how many we got, probably about 12, I guess. But now that we found something that they'll actually eat, should be able to finish this limit up relatively fast, I would say. Because, I mean, there's a bunch of fish, you know, 10 inches around here. Not a lot of big fish. But, hell, it'll make a taco. Look at that, I just dropped on this fish to see if he wants that crappy man green. Oh, yep, he does. He sees it. Come on. I think he's gonna swerve me. He thought he wanted that crappy man green. <laughs> the bigger fish definitely are on my hook right now because he swallowed it. <laughs> uh -huh. That's a little chunky one right there, guys. I'm just all sitting here talking, man. <laughs> I have figured out the, the secret code, and that is crappy man green. Which that's the secret code most of the time. I just started making that orange color, and I've been really liking it. But I'll take all these little tacos all day long. We ain't been out here for two hours. That's what I'm talking about. Oh man, but yeah, we've definitely cracked the code on them. So we might do a little live stream here for about an hour. Yeah, in a minute. I don't know for sure of how good my signal is here, but we're gonna try to catch one more right here, and then we're gonna finish the limit. All right, we are back at the house. We ended up with I think 18. Uh, major part that played a role was the 13 foot ACC with a sneaky sneaky little bait 
I don't even know if I want to tell you. But I am. The crappy fluke is what they wanted after the minnow. So we ended up with 18. Pretty good ones. Got a couple small ones, but is what it is. Hope y'all enjoyed today's quick video. You know, just going out, spending a couple hours on the lake. I think we fished for like four hours, so not too bad.